Have you ever gotten bored of having to load up a website every time you want a flat UI color palette? Well, there's an alternative and I'm going to show you how to use the alternative in this video. So to start off with, I've got a code pen open with three divs and they are all given the class flat and then given the BEM modifier convention for a modified blue version, green and red. And then I have this SAS below which targets the flat, just gives it a bit of styling and giving it a bit of padding in the background color for the body and I'm going to show you how I'm going to use the tool. So the tool is called Material Let, which is obviously material design merged with color palette, so it's Material Let. And it was made two days ago by this guy called Mike, and he's released two updates since, because originally it was just a Mac operating system only compatible program, but now he's added support for Linux and Windows, and he seems to be updating it quite, quite regularly, and yeah, so I'm going to show you how to use the program. I downloaded the zip file and extracted it into this folder. And if I run Material Let, then you shouldn't see much difference. But if you go down into your taskbar, then you'll see this. And we have all the colors available to us. We have different shades. So we're going to get the red one first. That's copied. And we'll put background and it copies the hex value. So that's updated. And then so we wanted, oops, we don't want that. Green, found a green. Uh, we'll go for that one. And finally we'll go for blue. So blue, that's a nice blue. And we now have our flat UI colors. Um, the black text doesn't really contrast too well, so if I had a color of white, I can get rid of that. And then I'm sure if we grabbed a nice little Google font to throw in there, yeah, we, hmm, I'm always picking up my fonts. Then, where's the ad? And I will just, that at the top and we'll grab the font family there you go looks better the font weight. Oh, actually I haven't got the font weight. but you get the idea so I now have flat UI colors I can access them at any time if I'm in Photoshop or if I'm in Illustrator, I want to pick out the same colors, I can just go in straight into my color palette and pick them out. Obviously, it's not essential for every designer, but it's a cool little tool I found today and I thought it could be quite beneficial. It has a wide range of different colors. Um, and if you wanted them all to be in the same sort of hue and sort of saturation, they all seem to be grouped quite well in a, like a vertical line. Um, you can pin it. So it's always open, you can hide it, you can exit it and close it down. There's hex, there's also RGB. So if you wanted to use RGB and you wanted to use RGBA maybe in your code, so you have a bit of opacity, then you can go ahead and do that. And yeah, that's the tool. And it sort of just saves you having to open up another tab and type in flat UI colors, find one. And even that color palette itself is quite limited. In the... Um, in this palette, you have a wide range of different colors to choose from, and they all follow a sort of material or flat design. So that's everything for this video, I just thought it was a cool tool and wanted to share it with you.